really exciting to be here today. We are at Brunel University for the first demo of the train fluid servicing robot. The project started in 2015 as an RSSP feasibility study supported by Chiltern Railways and then progressed further with Innovate UK's funding and with the support of an SME TBG solution. We've developed an automatic robotic system that's lab based that demonstrates how fluids such as water, uh, toilet effluent, fuel, uh, coolant and wheel sand even could be serviced on train vehicles. For us as an operator it's been really great to be here today. We were involved in the early RSSB project that looked at the feasibility of, of train fluid servicing. Robots that have a number of advantages for us as an industry. They can do tasks that are dull, that are dirty, that are potentially quite dangerous um, and actually do tasks that are very frequent much more efficiently um, and that's where I feel their real economic benefit is but also they reduce harm potential to our staff. So this one's interesting because uh, for us uh, we run a lot of fleets that have um, bi modes so electric and diesel and for us servicing is a really big part of our operations so anything that we can do to be more effective and more efficient at uh, fueling and servicing our trains are better. But in the UK it's quite clear that we need to innovate, we need to look at ways of reducing cost, we need to increase our availability of rolling stock because the demands are put on the railway industry today carrying more passengers, reducing our costs, and particularly the challenges we've got with decarbonisation. It's very important that programmes like this and others are developed to help us achieve the goals that we need to meet and meet the demands that we've got in the future.